Education is the great engine of personal development. It's through education that the daughter of a peasant can become a doctor. That the son of a mine worker can become the head of a mine. That a child of farm workers can become the president. With the current economic crisis, countries are reassessing their priorities. But from crisis comes opportunity, a chance to take a step back and see things in a new light. Education is an investment. You simply cannot have sustained economic growth and dynamism without a well-trained entrepreneurial workforce. And the facts bear it out. An extra year in education can increase earnings by 10%. The challenges remain significant. Today, 72 million children who should be in primary school are not. And over 776 million adults lack basic literacy skills. The World Economic Forum's Global Education Initiative gives children and adults access to education and provides them with the tools to find jobs or start their own businesses. With these goals in mind, the Global Education Initiative has developed a model of multi-stakeholder collaboration. This engages not only government, but also the private sector, civil society and donors at the local and global levels to provide society with the tools and skills they need to realise their dreams. So far, the Forum's Global Education Initiative has mobilised more than $100 million in Egypt, Jordan, Rajasthan, Palestine and Rwanda impacting more than 1.8 million teachers and students. Students like 13-year-old Egyptian Mohammed Mustafa, who does evening classes after school to advance his computer education. Yes, there is computer in school, but uh, this learns best better. It's so better than school. School learns just so basic things. goes to show that with the political will and support from development partners, we can make and have made progress, but we're still well short of where we should be. The World Economic Forum's Global Education Initiative supports UNESCO's Education for All and the UN's Millennium Development Goals in closing the global gulf in education. It also applauds other ongoing initiatives to raise awareness, such as the Global Campaign for Education, Class of 2015. It's time to reassess our attitudes to education and opportunity, and whose job it is to deliver them. Education is everyone's business and demands action from us all, from government, from civil society, from private companies, from you. Think about what your education has done for you, the opportunities it's given you, how it's opened your mind to feel and think, and just imagine what it could do for them. <laughs>